guys, today I'm going to show you what I've got for Jessica to put into her Christmas stocking. Um, so everything came from Amazon, so it was kind of a bit of a last minute shop that I did. I did it on Friday and everything has arrived. So I thought I'd show you this just in case you need some ideas and you can pay for quick postage and then you can get it before Christmas. Um, so I'll show you what I've got. The first thing are these toesies. They are really cool little slippers that I found. I've been thinking about getting Jessica a pair of slippers for ages, but I know that all of her shoes fall off. So I did a bit of research and I found out that you can get these things called toesies. They've got really cool grip sole bottoms to them. So they can learn to walk in them, which is really cool. And also the way that they attach onto the foot stops them from falling off. So you slide the foot in here. Apparently you pull the the um, the heel bit back, slide the foot in, then obviously curl the back up. And they've got elastic around the back here, so they stretch to fit properly. And then you um, use the sticky Velcro to stick them back down. And then hopefully they won't fall off if you've bought the right size. I guess if they're too big, then they'll still fall off. But yeah, hopefully they won't fall off. So I've got Jessica a size large, which was 12 to 18 months. They did them in loads of different colours and they even did them in red with white snowflakes. But I thought I'll get pink so they'll last a bit longer, hopefully. So that's the first thing. The next thing I got was this Munchkin cup. This is really good to teach the babies how to use a proper cup rather than with a little sort of tea on a cup. So it's like a proper rim to a cup and apparently the touch of a lip to the side of the cup allows the liquid to flow and then as soon as they put the cup down it reseals so it's spill proof so if they chuck it on the floor or knock it over it's spill proof as well. It feels like really tough hard plastic got two little grippy handles at the sides as well so that's really handy um, and yeah I thought this would be really good to teach Jessica how to drink from a proper cup so they also did this in a couple of colours I think there was green and red possibly but of course we went for pink for Jessica the next thing we got was this Aveeno baby moisturiser Let's see, it's called Soothing Relief Baby Emollient Cream. I noticed that Jessica is getting a little bit of dry skin on the sides of her arms after she's been in the bath or after she's been in the swimming pool. Now we do go to a swimming pool that uses a UV light to clean the water rather than actually putting chlorine into the water. So that's better for her, but we do live in a really hard water area too. So we have got a bath dechlorinator ball that I might do a video on to show you what that is. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd get this anyway because I don't tend to put anything on her skin at the moment. I'm a great believer in letting the skin do its job and letting the skin work and look after itself. But when I saw that little bit of dry skin, I thought actually some sort of cream or emollient suitable for baby skin might just help her a little bit. So I'm just going to put this on after bath time, maybe with a little massage at bedtime. That would be quite nice for her. And the last thing from Amazon that I got was this pop-up toy. Now Jessica uses one of these pop-up toys at nursery and she absolutely loves it. She's figured out that by pressing the buttons you can get the animals to pop up and by moving the things over you can get all the animals to pop up. So she's figured that out at nursery now. This is a twisty one, chicken. So um, yeah, so I got one of these. I think she likes to put them back down as well at nursery, they've told me. So I thought I'll get the exact same one that she's got there and then she'll know what to do with it. So those are all my Amazon buys and I've also got two other things to show you that I think you might like. This is a Jingle Bells bell rattle thing. I got it from our local shop called Sing Me Bobs. So I don't know where you might be able to find one, probably on Amazon if you type in bells on a wand or something, I'm not sure. I'll find out and I'll link it below. If you... We've already given this to Jessica, but I thought it would be quite a cool present to put inside a stocking as well because it's quite small. It'll fit into a stocking nicely and quite good fun as well for them to play with it on Christmas morning. And then lastly, something else that Jessica already plays with are these spiky balls. 
and they they light up if you bash them the lights flash on them i don't know if you can see and they light up so she loves Jessica loves playing with these flashing balls in a dark room. She chases them around, she grabs them, she likes feeling them. Um, but you have to be careful not to let them put them in their mouths. The lady that I bought them from said that they can maybe bite the little spikes off. I'm not sure. If they've got teeth, then they will, if they bite them, it might come off. I got them from her tiny talk instructor. Um, and she does sell them for babies. She just says, always play with them don't leave them on their own with them and make sure they're not biting the little knobbly bits off but yeah they're really good fun if it's dark it's so much fun to play with these so that was the last thing I had to show you um, I also bought her actual Christmas stocking on Amazon I was looking for quite a traditional one so I wanted it to be red with a white fluffy top and I um pom pom christmas stocking i searched for on amazon and i found a lovely one which i will show you a picture of it hasn't arrived yet so fingers crossed that will arrive before christmas but at least all of the presents have arrived so that's good um but yeah have a look at all of these things if there's anything you want and you can't find it just send me a message and i will try and help you find it but i will link everything in the comments box down below so you can have a look and see if the if those things are still available on amazon i hope you have a lovely christmas and i will see you after christmas